Okay, so that's the part where I left off. It's the situation here. Everything seems to be fine so far. There doesn't seem to be anything in need of my immediate attention. I have the ultra scan here, that is the functional. Here's the decontamination vault, decontamination room, whatever. Blood machine, the second pharmacy, cardio, to which there's quite often a line. One of the psychiatric rooms, since I have so many psychiatrists right now. Uh, this is for people with hieratis, not to be confused with people with uh, baldness. Definitely not the same thing. Training room, fairly empty at this point, except for this consultant psychiatrist who's trying to teach people, even though there's absolutely no one there to teach. All the GP offices over here. Not all of them staffed at this point, only two of them, so I should work on that. I could probably get a fourth bed in my world. I should probably get a bigger world or a second world if I need to, if I want to. It is actually necessary. If it's not, I can just ignore the idea. So how are things going? My reputation is amazing. It can take a bit of a hit and still be fine. I need a lot more money. I need to kill more people. 150, whereabouts. I need to raise my value, I mean the hospital's value, by a tiny bit. That's about it. Kill more people, get more money. My machines are falling apart. Bullshit. Actually, my machines are falling apart. I have 11 handymen. Plenty not enough to handle this. Let's employ this guy and have him fix all the things. Okay, buddy, fix all the things. By which I do not mean fix some of the things. All of them. Compensation for damage done to my reputation. Great. Because people in GP, GP offices are taking care of business. At this point, I could start over diagnosing people to an extent. Might not be the worst of ideas. Of course, I would love to have more surgeons, and this might be somewhat difficult to accomplish. Um, I have a surgeon over here, and he should be at the operating theater. I have spell doctors who can absolutely help in all sorts of matters. So this guy, for instance, should probably manage EP office. He's a consultant psychiatrist, so he can get deal with psychiatry, but then again, this psychiatrist is just, just as good. He's not, he's not just as good, but he's still... He'll, he'll do fine. Now this consultant is kind of tired, otherwise I would probably send him someplace else. Um... What I need to do is get my surgeons competent enough so that they can teach others, but I don't think that's... I don't think that's feasible at this point. I don't think that's gonna happen.
save this consult and train this guy. For a while, at least. We'll see how that turns out. Two people waiting. Do I have enough doctors? Doctor, attending psychiatry, please. Doctor required in GP's office. Is he going to the GP office? Sort of thing I want to have in my hospital. I got so many plans. And then all alike might be more difficult. Guy. Here he is. Quite tired on his way. Let's make use of some other people. streaming right now in my dropping frames just looked at it just looked at it and things were not fine far from it and now it's reconnecting but that's okay you know that's absolutely okay because my local recording is perfectly fine This guy's learning, but the guy teaching him is tired, and he's tired as well. Few more people. Oh, 130. Doctor wanted in electrolysis. And more money. Nurse required in pharmacy. Doctor required in decontamination. I might actually have this Doctor in my grasp. The effectiveness of my medicine. Seventy-eight plus O. Oh. I'm not there yet. Doctor required in 
So I need more research done, a lot more research done. I mean, come on, people. There's so much left to be discovered. So let's take this guy and have him learn. What could possibly ruin me now? Doctor, in cardio, Even an epidemic isn't something I would be afraid of because there are so few people in my hospital it just wouldn't be a problem at all. I would be able to get to them and I have the personnel to take care of this. In case it becomes an issue, it's absolutely something I can solve. Exploding machinery is something I am most afraid of, but I have... I have rebought it. So my machine should absolutely be up to snuff. Doctor needed in hair restoration. Why are you not fixing these things? Yeah, improving them one at a time. They're focusing on each one and then improving it to 100%, I guess. So gut rot is at 100%. Heaped piles, 100%. Glitz, 100%. Gastric ejections now at 90. Let's get some more handyman, I guess. This scanner could use some fixing, but other than that, most of the machinery seems fine. Yeah, almost everything, almost everything over here is fine. Okay, so I guess gastric ejections is 100%. Now they are focusing on chronic nausea. And they will go through all of this one at a time.
102 more patients and I'm done. Cure up to GP office. Okay, so I need to have... Where are my doctors over there? Fine, I need these people. heading towards an epidemic. Increase the hospital value by 565. I could get a few plants. I should probably. Let's get a drink machine. O2. Get a rookie surgeon and psychiatrist. I think I can justify the suspense. Doctor, attend immediately in cardio, please. Doctor, attend in the scanner room, please.
Suddenly my hospital got flooded with patients. I knew it was gonna happen. Contagious strain of gelitis. Let's let's try. Let's try to solve this. Need my nurses. Storming hospital. We get cash and a boost in reputation. Excellent. That's what I need. So many psychiatrists, this, this really should not be a problem. If only the user interface was a little less wobbly.
Oh, of course, it's empty. Great. All of a sudden, everyone had to go and break. Yeah. Okay, see, she's been diagnosed. All we need is. I had to get the treatment and everything will be fine. The GP up is great. It's kinda late. Am I seriously understaffed? Seems absurd. I definitely want this guy. Why wouldn't I want him? It's great at everything. Yeah. Had to pay for the 24,000, my reputation. Got hit, but still. I'm doing fine. I just need a bit more money. And to kill a few more people. Ten people with invisibility. Let's do this. And let's replace this. Consultant, surgeon, psychiatrist. Brilliant. Oh, this is the guy I, I just hired. Of course he is. I mean, I will do some training as soon as this lightens up. I mean, if there are fewer people in my hospital at any point, I might as well. If there are not, I can just keep my staff occupied. I don't see a reason not to. Happening. 
Every goddamn time. Figure out there's an emergency coming. Put, put, I put my personal where they are supposed to be. And they leave as soon as they absolutely need to be where they are leaving from. It just keeps happening. I need to keep them from leaving rooms because otherwise they will immediately leave. Because they don't see any point in being there for the time being. There's no one in the there's no one in the line, there's no one in the queue at that particular point in time. They are not trying to spite me, it's logical so. Here we have a nurse who's just being useless. Oh my. You know what? Go home. Go home. Ah. She's upset and she's leaving. In a way. So many people! What's this? What the I could have scanner? What was the problem? Don't tell me this glitched out! Don't tell- No! Come on, Doc! Oh, of course, the scanner needs to be repaired. Let's just replace it. I mean, if it needs to re be repaired so quickly... Wait, this guy still hasn't been taken care of? How, does, how is that even possible? Right, right. Just, just help him. It's not over yet. I get all of them. All of them, 10 out of 10. Alright. Almost 50% of the population. I, I just need some money. I think that's all I need. Do I need to increase the value or whatever? Yes, I still need to increase the value. Oh, it's the end of the year. What do I get? High salary. Uh, not necessarily the lowest death count. Let's do My machinery here. Yeah. Very clean. Good value. Um, soft drinks. Killing rats. Impressive kills to death ratio. Every hospital in the same area managed to get a bigger share of the population through its doors than you. There are three hospitals. And I have 48%. Not really. Best reputation. So how's the scanner situation going? Not great, I guess. I should put a consultant over there just to be a consultant in the GP office. What the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, Bowman. Fixed again? Can you just please fix it? Like seriously? 
Fix it. You just get a new one. Thanks to this guy, I am actually taking care of it at a reasonable pace. If you know, I am abusing the hell out of this. I wouldn't be all, all that much surprised if it exploded or something. I just need one more loom or something to increase the value. And more money. Three pearls once again. No, oh, not your pass. We 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 were just waiting for a patient who was far away because then you don't have enough benches, I guess. I guess I should place a few more benches. Yep, the value has been increased enough, built sufficiently. Now all I need is a bit more money. That's it. As long as everything else does not drop drastically. I think I should get a second scanner. Let's reroute some of the people over here. And don't leave your room. <sighs> Let's try this once again. There's a really slim chance of it working, but hey. I'll probably be still better off than I am today. Visiting. 
As long as I can get my nurses to actually vaccinate these people, I will in some way help. Should be fine. Yeah. People came to the scanner room, but of course the doctor who was there, no longer there. Consultant over here, so taking care of business and the. Uh... Doctor required in X-ray. <sighs> Come on, just stay in the. Master. Oh, of course. I know why, and I have a plan. Nobody, you don't need it here. I can just keep him in my hand because. Doctor required in GP's office. Doctor Actually, for a while, I can't. Okay, <sighs> quite a few people will be rerouted over there, so I need, I need two of these guys. Yeah, second doctor. Doctor, attend to the scanner room, please. Alright. Doctor wanted in electrolysis. So they are taking care of business on this end. How about the diagnostics? After GP office, all GP offices are swamped.
If only I could see the icons all the time. Because the game's engine just messes up. Sometimes. And the icons just disappear. Sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. It's a toss up. It's annoying as hell. I don't think I can. I would have to get a second operating field. No, I'm not doing this. Too risky. It's one of the few remaining risky things. Because I will need four surgeons at the same time. Not happening. Instead of with a fine of 24,000. Could have been worse. I just need more money. Oh, and the research of calls. Visibility is critiquing sleeping illness. Okay, not bad. So they all want kind of transparency right now. We have a few more things to go through, but it'll be... It'll be over fairly soon. Probably before I get the necessary money. Actually, if they can finish this by the end of the year, that would be great. Stop! Yeah. It's giving me a headache. The PA spam. Just the constant PA spam. We keep getting these messages and some of them... By the time you get them, they don't mean anything. I'm not sure that's gonna happen. Either way, I'm close enough to beating this level. By the end of the year, I should be able to finish it. All I need is about 200,000 more in the bank and a, a few 
few more things research. Three things. Okay. Three more things researched and a bit more money. Should be doable. Ah, yes. Gentlemen infected with haraiatics. Oh, gentlewomen. Yeah, I think I'll be fine. It's July. As soon as the last day of December passes, I should be golden. It should be over. Just need to wait now. Oh, it's, uh, it's, it's shifted a little bit. Yeah, I'll have to fix that. I mean, it's almost... It's almost fine. Just need to move it a bit to the left, I guess. A tiny bit. Yeah. Keep your fingers crossed for normal epidemics and it should be over momentarily. Transparency has been taken care of, I just need to take care of sl the sleeping illness. Research, the sweet itching research. Itching re ah, three things. I should probably concentrate research for now. Trying to have results. This. Are you kidding me? Of course not. I'm not even reloading any saves. Yeah, not a problem. Uh, I don't use any cheats. I I even have a rule for myself that I do not reload any saved games. And if I mess up, I just bite the bullet. I take the consequences and deal with them. The only reason I am saving every ever so often is because the game tends to crash from time to time. I mean, it's a nice game, but <sighs> has its downsides. It def definitely has its flaws. And among them is the fact that, you know, it's just not necessarily polished. I mean, the design is great, but the technical side is just... Sometimes it even feels unfit. No! Well, there goes... There goes my x-ray. I don't need a second... Uh, no, I should be fine. So I really want to even get a second x-ray right now. It's such a huge room. Let me check on my research really quickly. Okay, so I focused on invisibility.
All right, invisibility has been improved. I'm supposed to bring things up to at least 80%, I think. At least 80%, all right. Has allegedly been improved. I don't see the improvement. Oh my. Okay. Still not 80%. Oh no. Yeah, and now the epidemics will just bash me over the head. 30,000. Let's try to do what I can. It's risky, but I believe it's something I can handle. I should be able to handle this. Because if people get upset and leave, my chances might diminish even more, but still. Hopefully this will be enough. Get one more nurse, I guess. Nurse Let's vaccinate all of them. Nurse in pharmacy. Nurse in pharmacy. And immediately send them to cure. Going to the pharmacy, so I think things should be fine. Oh boy, it's spreading. They don't leave, it should be fine. Just don't leave. Uh, let me guess, I need. I probably should rebuild the x ray, but not now. Should have gotten a bigger world or a second world. Doctor wanted in electrolysis. Doctor, attend immediately.
Ja, hat sie sich. I'll have to take a reputation hit. Hopefully it won't be excessive. How's the research going? Invisibility is still 78%. I have no idea how this works. I honestly don't know anymore. Hey Dev! How you doing? Once again, this this time I know for pretty much sure that there were people in my hospital uncured who were still infected, and yet I got this. I don't get this. No! No, they will not receiving treatment. Someone was queued up to the GP office, someone was doing something else, was going to the cardiogram. Bam! I receive compensation. No! No, they were waiting. I think what it means is that it, it, it doesn't count people who are sick. As long as you can actually vaccinate them, you know, you can tag them with the nurse and they're fine because they are no longer spreading the infection, right? They are no longer spreading the infection, they are no longer contagious and therefore they are not counted towards this. As long as you can tag all of them before the, the counter ends, I think you're fine. So it's not a matter of curing all of them before it ends, which is, uh, which is the case with, epi uh, not with epidemics. With, um, with these guys, with emergencies. You get an emergency, you need to cure all of them. But if you get an epidemic, you need to tag all of them, or cure all of them. I don't know. Eight people with serious radiation. Should I take this? I mean, I... No. And I should probably get a second x-ray, which is unfortunate, but... Because my x-ray exploded! Oh, lovely. the x-ray but everything else seems absolutely fine seems like everything else is absolutely fine for now I am on the cusp of winning this I almost have it I need 500 uh, 500 thousand right I almost have it I need some research I almost have it look at this Pretty much everything is at 100% except for discrete itching, which is at 94, I need to have everything uh, above 80, or at 80, and invisibility. And I don't get this, I clicked concentrate research and it doesn't seem to do anything. It's not getting over 78. As long as I can get the research done and I can get the money, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I need to have the patience to check all of these things. Yes, I am. That's the that's the point. 
I'm spending 41% on specialization. It's it's not doing anything. I don't get it. I mean, I will get the money. I just need to have the research. And the end of the year is now. I don't want to spend another year in this hospital. I want it to be over. Just end my misery. Come on. So close. Will it be enough? <sighs> I don't want it to be another year. I really don't. So the hospital is very clean, soft drinks, uh, very clean, highest value, impressive kills to death ratio, amazing reputation. No, it's not over yet! The invisibility drug has been improved by my research department. Can you see this message? Because I sure as hell can. Take a look at this. You look at invisible. Oh, they have improved it. Used to be a lot. But that's just because. Yeah, because discrete itching has already been improved. This point is meaningless. Been replacing machines like crazy. I have wasted quite a bit of money on that, and still something exploded, namely the X-ray. So I don't know anymore. Either way, everything is in tip. Sh I've, I've been replacing this scanner so many times now. It's just crazy. I have enough. I really do. I just need a hundred thousand. That's that's all I want. It's the final stretch. As long as no epidemics strike, I can just rely on a steady income, it should be fine. She ran into the room on the Pretty much everyone has been taken care of because they have access on the frogs. You know what I mean. And the only person who doesn't is getting their treatment, so he's no longer sick. Now, if all these people can just get the treatment they need, it should be fine. Okay, there's no one over here, so I need to put this guy here so that he can quickly take care of her. 
And this epidemic being over... I know, I know, I will fix it soon enough. Trust me on this one. Do you have trust issues? Please don't let her die. I think you can end the, the epidemic prematurely if you cure all the people. But if you just vaccinate all of them, I think it ends normally. Okay, so if that was the la Yes, it was the last person. I got absolutely demolished that epidemic. And now I should receive compensation. Of course, this needs to be repaired. I did sleep better this I necessarily better, but you know. At a better moment. I'm getting my sleep schedule back on track slowly but surely. It's not a it's not a one-time process. I will still be tired at such a such a reasonable hour, but still. Okay, I got some money as compensation, so that's good. About seventy-five thousand dollars and I'm done. The research has been... I think I've got my research done, don't I? Yes, the invisibility drug is at... Yeah, it's at 100%. So all the improvements are done. Uh, I mean, no, not improvements. So the improvements are all that's left. Because my drug research is, at, is no longer needed. It has been completed. I could actually just release the researchers into the wild and have them kill patients. And diagnose them, of course. By the way, I don't have a. I'm not worried about. I'm not worried about my psychiatrist because check this out: psychiatrist and a surgeon, psychiatrist and a surgeon. Well, almost psychiatrist, but still, psychiatrist, 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 and a surgeon. Psychiatrist, you get the idea. I have a few consultants, but most of them also have specializations. I just hired one the other day. And I st still think it was worth it, even though I'm paying him every month, I could have had the money. I think spending the money to get a... I think he was both a consultant and a surgeon and a psychiatrist. Doesn't really get better than that. I did not need him to be a researcher because, let's be honest about it, I don't really... I don't need researchers at this point. I'm almost done. So close now. One room that is a researcher. You mean aside from the research department. 
Even if there is one, it's not one I have encountered quite yet. Later. Well, thanks for the spoiler, man. Still consider it a spoiler. All right. Three surgeries. That's a lot of money. Two more surgeries. As long as no disaster hits, it should be absolutely fine. Almost over. Less than 20,000, come on! certain my regular psychiatrist should handle matters here whereas my surgeon psychiatrist should do surgery oh this guy's a surgeon as well oh well I got it I have fulfilled all the victory conditions now will it end Please be over. Come on. Let's just wait for the end of the year. Yeah, the PA spam, it's just... it's so annoying! Fine, let's get more handy now. Final 
Finally! Before the end of the year, the university have been vastly successful in your tenure at this hospital to this end. We predict great things for you and would like to offer you a position elsewhere. The salary would be a million hundred thirteen thousand hundred seventy one dollars and we think you'd love the new challenge it would pose. Would you like a position at Crow King Hospital? I don't know. I have no idea. Either way, let's accept this. And I'm... No bonus level! It's lovely. Is it this... Is it the second to final thing? I mean, look at the bolt. Is it the, is it the second to last or is it the last one? I mean, when you reach the very center, is that still a level or is it second to last or last? Because you, if you look at the ball, it seems like the next step is just victory and not just not another level. So I don't know about this. Second to last. Well, that's that's good enough. You've been given the chance to build the ultimate in hospital. Sounds like the last level to me. This is an exceedingly prestigious area and the ministry would like to see the best possible hospital. We'll be expecting you to make big money. You have a superbly high reputation and cover every possible... I have a superbly high reputation cover every possible eventuality. It's an important job, this. It'll have to be something special to pull it off. Note too that they'll have that they'll have sight. That's, that's not grammatically correct. Note too that they'll have sightings of UFOs in the area. Make sure your staff are prepared for some unexpected visitors. The hospital will need to be worth. 240,000, you'll need 500,000 in the bank, and your petition is to be 700. That's nice. And I start up with the usual assortment of thingies. So whether it is the second to last or the last, I don't care. I'll just save it and then restart it later on. I've had quite enough of the hospital for today. Phew. So what do you think I, I should switch by? Actually, let me run a poll. Why not? Oh, and... An important thing to do is also to move the hitbox chat thingy so it properly aligns with the chat. Huh. Okay, and I think that's I think that's absolutely fine. Okay, let me run a poll. Yep. Yeah. Let's have the usual entries on the list anyway. So vote now!
Well... Okay, fine! Let me add the Chainsaw Warrior. Nobody's favorite. I could also add Poker Knight, you know. Speaking of which, where's Knight? Probably busy. Wait, hold on. Um, it's 5 p.m. over there. Might be quite early while he lives, now that I think about it. What do you mean, what happened? Uh, nothing yet. The other game... The other game is called Feria. And it's a game I spotted on Kickstarter, which is the reason I got my key. Now, the thing about Feria is I used to play it, and I used to like it very much. At this point, I don't know how I feel about it. And I had a chance to play it for about three days when they opened the test to the public after previously a few months ago, closing it entirely and making it completely internal. It was a weird move on their part, but then again, understandable, because eventually, after extensive testing open to the public, they simply could not pull the numbers. Fewer and fewer people wanted to play the game, and since the, since the test was open, it was a simple fatigue. The test was open 24-7, so eventually people figured, I have something better to play right now. And as the concurrent number of players started to drop, less and less players started to gather, because it's, there's, there's no fun in waiting for a game if you cannot find anyone to play with. And it just spiraled out of control, so there were almost no people. So they closed the test and only performed internal tests from then on. Until they opened it for a uh, three-day period, of which I cut the tail end because I was at, um, at the wedding. And since then they have not re reopened the beta. Um, and since then they have not reopened the beta. They have not reopened the beta since. So that's the story with Feria. I mean, they are, they are reworking a few call systems when it comes to the game. Back then, you used to have different resources. You used to have actions, gold, and feria. And they figured that people traded all of the actions for the gold and only treated feria as the side resource you sometimes want to get, and gold was the main resource. So they decided to get rid of the gold have a static number of things you can do in a turn and only rely on Feria for resource, which made the game somewhat shallow, but also kind of improved it. I've played Feria before I played Hearthstone, and I, I really like the concept. But in comparison, it'll be difficult to say. I mean, Hearthstone... Hearthstone is simple, Feria is also fairly simple, so I guess that's the next thing. I mean, it, 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 is, it is a card game theoretically, but in practice it is somewhat of a bold game. I mean, come on, one vote, vote on the poll, people, it should be in front of you. You know, Feria is to an extent a bold game, because it's not like you just... Have, have the board on which you can put creatures, you can put them in a particular spot, and placement matters. It matters quite a bit. Um, I, as I've mentioned, I'm not, I'm not necessarily fond of it when games do not take themselves seriously. I think Hearthstone takes itself seriously to a certain... at least partially. Within the game, there are things that can be treated seriously, that you can actually be somewhat emotionally invested in, as opposed to just having a laugh at everything. It's not... To an extent, it's not serious, but it, not in the sense of being just sarcastic about everything, but instead of being 
but but in the sense of being humorous, I would say. So so it's not. It's a funny game. I'll put it that way. It's it's funny, but it's not. It's not a cheap parody of anything. It's not the sort of game that you cannot take seriously as a result of it not taking itself seriously. I mean, I've mentioned before, I don't really have the best of... Uh, it's difficult even for me to define what sort of... Um, uh, how, I, how I treat things that do not take themselves seriously and what the term even means precisely. Quite a few things can be said to not take themselves seriously and I would necessarily be against all of them. But then again, there will be some of them which I will definitely not favor for the atmosphere that they foster within the presented world. Because if I cannot take the world given to me seriously, there's very little that I actually can salvage the game. And in Halfstone, when it comes to Halfstone, there's of course the actual gameplay itself. But the gameplay itself wouldn't be as compelling as it is if it wasn't for the atmosphere the game fosters, which is something even Altosis, a very mechanic-oriented player, has noticed himself, and many people have noted it, the fact that the game eases you into itself by this atmosphere of actually being in an inn and only playing the board game in this inn, so you're playing a game within a game. Okay, so two votes have been cast. I'm just waiting for the third vote so I can decide. And the third vote can be cast for a third title, or the third vote can be a tiebreaker. If it's a tiebreaker, it makes my decision a little bit easier. If it's for, for a different title, I will just have to pick between them. Yeah, Walker. <sighs> I mean, Warcraft 3 to an extent also does not take itself seriously in the fact that you can keep clicking the units and they have these amusing quotes that you can get to that are not particularly serious, they break the fourth wall and all that. And the characters are also to an extent caricatures, so you might say that they shouldn't be taken all that seriously, but still, the world is serious to an extent it take, and takes itself seriously. And there is a degree of... Exactly. And it is dramatic to an extent, which I think is, is amazing. I do like games that actually try to be dra... I know, that's the... Um... Okay, two votes for Heroes of the Storm, one vote for Necrodancer. So I'll be switching to Heroes of the Storm shortly. And I will not be expanding upon the whole drama subject because that's for another day and for another podcast. God damn it, I can just sit here with a paused game and look for eternity. It might be hot. I, I figured I would actually do something today. But you know, I could do that. Maybe. I'll be back with Heroes of Storm in just a bit.